that's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. <laughs> Big time takedown right there. This might just be it for him, Michael. He's looking at it. DDT! Can he finish the job? Corey, check this out. Yeah, that was amazing. Here he goes. I can't help but be impressed by these three superstars, guys. This has been absolutely intense. Tremendous ring presence from the... Oh my god, guys. Oh, Look no. at this. Oh, let's do this. Sunset. You gotta believe this one's over. I've seen countless triple threat matches over the years, and I can confidently say that this one ranks right up there with some of the all-time best. Oh boy, he is rolling. The match isn't even over, and I can already tell you that this is one of the most exciting triple threat matches I have seen in a very long time. Oh boy, he is rolling. I don't know how these superstars are doing it right now. They've got to be exhausted. Hooked up and backdrop suplex. Here we go. Ooh, what impact. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Not going to stop until it gets the job done, I guess. He's out there in no man's land. Yeah, he's got to find a way to get... He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. He wants to do this in the ring. Oh, nasty impact. He's lining him up. A second time. To think, I almost rode him off earlier. Here's a cover. One, two, three. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. Extreme Rules is not for the faint of heart, as you can see in these highlights. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history.
That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Here is your winner, Buddy Murphy. Going to feel the effects of this win for a while. If you're not feeling good about yourself after a win like that, you better get yourself checked. We've got an animated crowd here tonight, as we usually do when we're in Orlando.